with Meera Aunty, Maya Katha. And today I'm going to share a story with Sarah. Hi, hi, Namaste, Vanakkam. And what story Meera Aunty has got? It's a story once upon a time, long, long ago. Have you heard about this person called mm, Tenali? Tenali, Tenali. Yes, it's a story about Tenali Raman. Tenali Raman. A puny fellow. A skinny fellow <gasps> and here it was heavy my god he was known for his wit wisdom and those you know clever thoughts and acting in the moment what story have I got today for you come wherever you are Wherever you are, come, let's go to this place, the city called Hampi. Hampi, yes. And how do we go to Hampi? Ah, oh, we are going to once upon a time, long, long ago. Not in the train, not in the airplane, not in the bus, and not in the auto and no rickshaw no cycle come close your eyes Meera auntie will take you how I'm gonna sing a song and let's go in a bullock cart yes in a bullock cart bullock cart hello 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 ailasa hello ailasa come sing with me Hello, Ailasa. Hello, Ailasa. Let's go to Humpy. Yes, let's go to Humpy. A beautiful city. Once upon a time, what did Tenali do then? Hello, Ailasa. Hello, Ailasa. Hello, Ailasa. Hello, Ailasa. Are, 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 stop, 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 stop. What, Amma? What happened? Asked that man. Are, Baba, we have come to Humpy. Close your. Open your eyes. Did you open your eyes? Just rub it like this. Ah, can you see? Ah, we have come to beautiful Humpy. You know, it was, it was, it was, it was under the king, Vijayanagara Samrajya, Krishna Devarai. And we had Tenali over there. Oh, did I say this? Tenali was also traveling along with us in the bullock cart. Let's ask him to join us. Oh, Tenali! And along with him, his wife too. Mrs. Tenali. Yes, both of them have joined. And they are going to tell the story. How? Come, let's hear. Tenali and his wife, they were going to Humpy. On the way, they were feeling very thirsty and they wanted to quench their thirst and they had some water. They stopped over at a place to have water. And suddenly, they could see some hallabulla, hallabulla, hallabulla. Hey, 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 hey. Tenali's wife, she asked Tenali, What's happening over there? Tenali, oh, like I know. I'm also along with you. I don't know what's happening. Come, let's go see what's happening over there. They both of them went. A ground, a maidan. Loads of crowd over there. Then Ali was trying to get inside. Oh, he couldn't. They just pushed. They pushed. They pushed. And both of them, yes, Tenali and Mrs. Tenali, both of them managed to come 
towards the you know towards the ground and they saw someone lifting heavy stuffs not like this like this what these and the nearby people are talking aha see are that man lifts 200 kg rice bag with ease tenali's wife 200 kg amma how did he manage to do that and she looks at tenali tenali looks lost in her thoughts then mrs tenali guessed it aha this man is up to something he is planning something let's see let's see and she just looks at tenali what are you planning sir he just looks at her wait i'll just go tenali walks towards the village sarpanch in couple of leads over there and he asks what is he doing over there in the middle of the ground why is he lifting all those rice sacks village sarpanch <laughs> What are you? From where are you coming? Can't you see? He is a pehel one, and he can lift two hundred kgs rice bag like this with ease. Tenali was just looking at the serpent. He looked at the pehel one, and looked at the rice bag, and he just said, "Okay, even I can do this. Maybe I can do something more than this." Well, it's serpent. looked at him <laughs> you such a tiny such a puny oh my god can you lift that bag you know the empty sack can you give it to him can he lift this then ali looked sir i can carry that hill over there you can see the hill everybody in the village the pehelwan who was just having the right sack in his hand third you know he dropped it on the ground Then Ali's wife with a smile on her face, and the village serpent was like, "Huh? That hill? That hill? You're gonna carry it on your back, Then Ali? Then Ali? Yes, sir. I would do that." Village serpent was like, "Okay, okay. Come, let's do." He says, "On one condition." He looks at the pehelwan and asks. How many days of practice required for you to lift that two hundred kg rice bag? He said three months. Then Ali, <clears throat> um, okay, I have my calculations right. Will it, sir? Punch. I need six months for me to practice to carry that hill. It's so huge, and you can see how my shoulders are. Not only that, I need someone to massage my shoulders. I need someone to take care of my daily needs. I want food all time. I need, you know, the dresses to wear because I don't have money. Village serpent said, "Are you okay? I'll arrange for all these things." Tenali, Mrs. Tenali, they got a beautiful house to stay. Every time some or the other entertainment at the house, the food was available any time, and they had beautiful, wonderful dresses. You know, the garments to wear. and massage for tenali's those little shoulders they had a great time 1 2 3 4 5 months got over and then and then the village sarpanch the village folks all of them came oh tenali have you forgotten the promise that you made tenali comes out slowly No sir. I remember. I remember the promise that I made. Come. Let's go to the ground. Come. Then Ali's wife was like, "Oh, this man will he really carry the hill on his back? What is he planning to do?" She goes to the ground along with Tenali, along with the village folks and the sarpanch, also Pahalwan. You know who was massaging Tenali's shoulder? It was the Pahalwan. Pahalwan was like, "Okay, let me see how he's gonna lift. Sorry, carry that hill." Will it, Sarpanch? Okay, then Ali, carry the hill. What then Ali does? He just, you know, he just stiffens us, stretches all that, and he just stands like this and he says, "Ha, huh? keep it, keep it on my shoulders. I'll carry it. Go, go, 
Do it now. Keep it on my shoulder. I will carry it. Will it serpent just what? You said you will lift it? No serpent. I said I will carry it. I never said I will lift it. You you all can do one thing. Why don't you lift the tail and put it back on my shoulders and I will carry it? Everybody laughed. Everybody laughed. That's Tenali. Witty. Oh, witty. With full of wisdom. So, it's all about how we think, you know, at that particular moment. The word which we say can create a lot of stories. And this is Tenali's story about lifting, carrying the hill on his back. We'll come back with yet another story. Oh, you guys are all in humpy. Come. Tenali. We leave Tenali and Mrs. Tenali in Humpy because that's where they want it to be, right? Bye-bye. Come say bye to Tenali and Mrs. Tenali. Bye-bye. All of you, come, 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 come. Come back. Close your eyes and let's go to your respective places. Oh, I'm back to my place. Hope you're also back. Thanks for joining Mira Auntie Maya Kata with a story. Thank you, Sarah. Bye bye. See you.